look in the camera. Hello everyone and welcome to Tabor Talk. Here's my guy Shiloh. I'm your host Michael Tabor. I'm going to do another cat video. As you know people I am a cat guy. I love cats. Um, growing up as a kid our family we grew up with cats and dogs and I love dogs too but I prefer cats. So Madeline and I are cat people. We've been married now for 23 years. And we've known each other for 27 years. We've lived together and we lived in sin for a bit. Then we got married, 23 years, all right? So um, we've always had cats and it was a thing. First, you know, we had an apartment. I lived in, uh, we lived in Queens for a while. I hated it, I lived in Briarwood, Queens. I lived in Rego Park, and then Briarwood, and then we were there for like six years, something like that, maybe five, six years, and then we moved to Long Island, we bought a house in 2000, and we lived in Seaford. But, so, we think about our life and our cats. When I met Madeline, she had a black and white cat like this, Macbeth, and she hated me, and anyway won't get into that her cat died and I had this cat this little gray and white domestic cat named Dallas and he sadly and it still brings tears to my eyes he got away from me when I was moving with Madeline and uh, that was in Rigo Park and it's a long it's another whole story but it brings tears to my eyes anyway so um, our first cat in the apartment in Queens was a Siamese, Isis. Madeline names all our cats. So that was really our first cat together, Isis. And what a personality, this cat. She was, um, boy, he's being nice. I'm going to get to him in a second. He's calm. He's a wild one, actually. But so, so Isis was a Siamese. She bit, she was mean, and she would attack you. But what an interesting personality. My wife, Madeline, has written several blogs. Uh, it's on, you see, you used to, we used to put them on my blog, What Do We Think? We've shut it down. But anyway, um, what an amazing cat. We, when we moved to our house in Seaford, we brought, obviously, we brought her along, and she lived to 20. Isis died in 2014. Okay, so let me go back. Let me go in order. Our first cat was Isis, Siamese. Our second cat was another Siamese, but a snowshoe Siamese. He was white, you know, Siamese features, but we had white on him. Snowshoe Siamese, checking out, white paws, adorable boy. And we had, and they never got along. They fought like crazy. And I remember like a year after we moved in, so we, we got Isis and then we just got snowshoe. And after September 11th, I was working on Long Island, the horrible towers fell, I went home. I had to leave the office. I come home, and everyone's like, oh my God, the world's coming to an end. And these guys, Isis and Snowshoe, were fighting. They were totally oblivious to what was going on in the world. I thought that was kind of interesting. So, anyway... Years go by, we had these cats outside, you know, like around. We lived on Long Island, and, it, well, you know, a lot of feral cats. And suffice to say, we took one in, and we still have her, Clementine. She's, Clementine's like 10 years old. So we had three at one time. We So we had Isis, Snowshoe, the domestic cat, gray and white, outside. And then we got one more in 2012. We got another snowshoe Siamese off the internet, Tyler. And I've showed you pictures of him before. He's inside. And what a beauty and what a strange cat, too. He's very aloof. He's never purred in his life. He's absolutely beautiful looking, exotic. And But he's ne now he's getting wild. He's starting to bite me. <laughs> and, and he's never purred in his life. So anyway, before we moved here to our log cabin. We first moved to Goshen, an apartment now here, our log cabin, our dream house. Um, we, we, our, two, our two guys, Isis died, she lived to 20. She died, it was awful, horrible, 2014. And then my other boy, Snowshoe, died after I got out of the hospital, so it was a double whammy. I got out of the hospital in um, 
September of uh, 2014 and November of 2014. My boy, Snowshoe, died. He was so sweet. I loved him so much. And um, anyway, here we are. We got three cats now. We got Clementine, which is the gray and white one. We have Tyler, which is the weird, aloof one who never purrs. And then now, here I get, finally, to Shiloh. Shiloh is a maniac. And boy, he just farted. <laughs> you miss. <laughs> like, he farts up a storm. Come on, Shiloh. And he wants to get away. We, keep, we don't... Our cats are inside cats. And he's biting me because he wants to... See all these cuts and everything? So... He was nice before, but now he's a maniac. And I got to tell you, this guy, I love him more. Listen, I love, my cats are like my children. And they all, they're all they all different. I love them all. And it's, you know, I don't pick just one. But this guy's personality, he's being a dick now. But he is this big personality. He, let me, let me how, how should I describe him? He's so... Fun. He's full of energy and he's running up and down. And yet he could be, and, he, and by the way, he's the boss. He's the alpha. You talk about pecking order. Like he totally dominates Tyler and and Clementine. When there's food, he just moves right in. He's the boss. It was funny. Like two months ago, when we got him as a kitten, he was this big, like literally, like 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 three inches, like tiny, weighed less than a pound. He was a half pound. And now he's like, look at the size of him. Let's see here. Okay, so he's getting bigger. He's growing. And he is so strong. And he's a scrapper. This guy is fucking fearless, man. Look at him. And isn't he beautiful? Oh, my sweetie. Oh. Okay. All right. Um, I think I'll end it here. I hope you love my cats. Say, say goodbye, Shiloh. I'm going to put you back inside. You're not allowed outside, Shiloh. You know that. He always tries to go outside. He's so sneaky. We have our back door here and even the other doors. We have back door, front door, and then we have downstairs or kind of through the basement. And he's sneaky and he hides. He's super smart and he wants to go on his own. You can't, Chilo. You know, someone said he looks like Hitler, like a Hitler cat. See that spot, that black spot? What do you think, Tyler? Not Tyler, Shiloh. Sorry, Shiloh. Say something to the camera, Shiloh. I'm going to bring you right up. Say something. Oh, come on, Shiloh. <laughs> come on. Say something. <laughs> okay. Good friends, good books, and a sleepy conscience. Peace, love, and understanding here on Tabor Thought. Bye, Shiloh.